Bible says, And Othniel, the son of Kenaz, the brother of Caleb, took it, and he gave him Aksa, his daughter, to wife. Here we see a small character named Othniel, Caleb's nephew, receiving part of his uncle's inheritance. Why is it such an important thing that the Lord makes note of this man, Othniel? Because Othniel also becomes the first judge of Israel in the book of Judges, chapter 3. The first one to deliver Israel from the oppression of the king of Mesopotamia. Caleb was a great man, a man who wholly followed the Lord. Only one of two men to make it out of the original deliverance in the Exodus to make it to the promised land. And here his nephew becomes the first judge that Israel needs to deliver them from the oppression and the bondage of the enemy. That says, dear child of God, that your walk with God influences someone else today. That walk with God and your faithfulness will rub off on the people that are closest to you, your family, your friends, those who see you every day. Othniel must have seen his uncle Caleb so strong and so faithful and so devoted to God that when the Lord needed to raise up a judge, Othniel was ready for the call. What kind of impact are you having on the people around you today? What kind of faithfulness or lack thereof are you showing others today? The Bible says, No man liveth unto himself, and no man dieth unto himself. Be sure, dear Christian, that you are not alone today and the people in your circle of influence are watching you. Do they see faithfulness, devotion, courage, faith? Or do they see laziness, compromise, hypocrisy? May your influence shine on someone else today that they may go and do something great for God when you are long gone.